Hey guys, it's the Fujo Fairy here coming at you with another video. Um, so in the mail yesterday, I got a really nice surprise. Um, this is for um, my other fellow Fujo, Fujoshis, Fudanshis, whatever. If you enjoy BL, um, I have a great surprise for you. Uh, there is this new subscription uh, service called the Yaoi Crate. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Yes, the Yaoi Crate. Um, they're doing like, if you know what a subscription box is, they just send you random shit every month. And this one is going to be Yaoi themed, so I'm so excited. It is a little bit um, on the pricier side. It's $49.99 a month, I'm pretty sure. Um, but... I think it's worth it, um, especially since everything's going to be licensed goods, um, so, you know, it's mainly to support the authors and all the people, all the other things and whatever is going to be in the box, so, um, I got it yesterday, um, I'm really excited to show you guys, um, yeah, so here's the box, it's very just plain. I'm not going to show you the other side because it has, like, my address on it. This just has this little, like, this little eye thing. That was the only thing that came just to cover, um, the front part. Um, but yeah. I'm going to unbox it. So, if you already ordered this box and you don't want any spoilers don't watch this video because I'm gonna show everything that I got in it um, just know that I really liked everything that I got in it um, I'm pretty sure this was the first month so that was really exciting um, there's no real theme to it I don't think so um, so it's just like random yaoi related items BL related items so uh, yes also I'm pretty sure this box is 18 plus so if you're not 18 Please click away from this video. Please do not buy this box because it's not meant for you. Okay? Thank you. So, let's get started. So, the first thing as soon as you open it, which I really, really enjoy. I literally gasped <laughs> when I opened this box. So, I like that the, the, the box is plain. And then the inside is just like, <laughs> just boys <laughs> doing boy things. Um, also, I want to talk about these cute ass little, um whatever they're called peanuts and like these little fake rose petal things they're so cute so I really like the packaging a lot in this um, I'm really happy with the way it looks I'm happy that they didn't really write anything on the outside because you know other people see this box like just the outside at least so you know you don't want everyone knowing that you are buying gay porn <laughs> all the time so it's nice to have it a plain box and then you know when you open it you see this beautiful piece of artwork honestly it's so gorgeous I don't know what I'm gonna do I might just cut the box so I can keep that piece because it looks so good okay so let's get started with the unboxing part the first thing um, that I just took out is this cute little pin that says proud Fujo uh, it's so cute and it's really like good quality I like the back of it as well all right. The next thing I got it was in this little, little like um whatever these bags are called. I'm not exactly sure. They just put stuff in. I'm pretty sure it's two little keychains. Yes, they're two little keychains. I got two of the same ones. I don't know if that was intentional or not, but I'm fine with it. They're both really cute, so it doesn't really matter. I can give one to, like, a friend of mine so we can have, like, matching ones. But they're really cute. They're so adorable. Um, let me just take it out of this plastic so you can see it better. So, um, this is the boy from one of the... Dogens. I don't know if I mentioned it, but we got two Dogens in this, which is really exciting. But this is one of the boys from the Dogens that um came with it. So I'll just show you like a better. Where's the camera? Better look at it. It's really cute. It's a cute boy with white hair, and then here's a little clip thingy. So it's really well made. Honestly, it's pretty thick plastic, and it's a little bit like holographic. Let's put this to the side. And the next thing I got, which I'm really, really excited about, um, I've always wanted one of these, like, physical, is a BL drama CD. Oh, my God. Ah. 
it's so good it looks so good oh. i can't wait to read it i mean to listen to it not read it um it's called halloween nights wings voice drama he's mine oh okay <laughs> um but yeah this one's it looks really good um they send an email out i think today which is today's thursday um with like a code to a digital copy copy digital copy digital copy of this um bl uh drama cd so i'm more than likely kind of just gonna listen to it on my computer so j i haven't listened to it yet but i'm excited to listen to it it sounds interesting so here is what the disc looks like here's like the little uh pamphlet thing i'm gonna take it out so i can show you guys better that's what it looks like halloween nights i really like this cover image they both look really good and then here are i guess the characters in it i'll just show you real quick you can stop and read their like little descriptions i'm excited for this i'm pretty sure like these are the couples like each of them i'm excited for this one i love some like old men bl for some reason there's not a lot and sometimes when i find a good one it kind of excites me so i'm excited to listen to these two i i don't know yeah top bottom yeah <laughs> so i think they are together which i'm excited to listen to that part um yeah let me see Let's keep going. And the next thing, next two things I got, I'll just show them together. I think these are the last things. All right, the last two things I got were two, oops, two doujins. Two doujins. The first one's called The Psych, uh, what's it called? Psychopath and the Killer by Bari Hori. Um, this one's really cute. I actually read, read, already read this one. It was a quick. Like, it's only a couple pages long. Um, <clears throat> like a, It's just little short stories about this cute little couple, a psychopath and a killer. Um, it was really adorable for, like, what it's called. Like, it looks like it's more, like, dark and stuff. But it's not actually really cute and adorable. I, like, laughed out loud the first... Um, <laughs> On the first page, um, they were the two. These two guys were doing it, and um, one of the guys was like, "Oh, you gotta put a condom on, or I'll get pregnant." And the other guy was like, <laughs> and, it, "And he started crying, and it was just the funniest. I don't know. It was just funny. So I really like like this one a lot. I started following this, the author on Twitter. Here's so you can. This is this part, their um, Twitter handle to follow them. They have really good um, artwork. I really like the artwork in this as well. I'll show. Let me show an example that's not rated R. I mean, I can just show you this. <laughs> and I'll show you this. Yeah, they're really cute. I like this one a lot. Um, this one I have not read yet. It's called Magneta Dreaming. It looks really cute. This one, definitely a little bit longer than the other one. Um, this one is by... Oof, okay. Kyushio Saiki x Rita Torisuka. Wait, is this Psyche? Hold up. Oh my god, wait. Is this a Psyche Dojin? <laughs> oh my god, it's... <laughs> Okay, that just made my entire life. This is a Psyche K. If you have not watched Psyche K on Netflix, please do. This is one of the best, it one of the best comedy animes I've ever seen. It's fucking hilarious. And this is a Psyche K doujin. Can we just take a second to appreciate this? Oh my god, this is hilarious. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't wait to read this one. Okay. That's exciting. Holy crap. Uh, I didn't even... Oh, I mean, they make doujins about everything, so... Okay. Whew. That was the most exciting thing I've ever seen. I'm excited to read this one now. Wow, I didn't know... Did not know there was a Psyche K. <sighs> wow. I'm excited. Okay. Whatever. Beside the point. Um, the artist is called Iro Hoshino, and this is 
just like their information that's their twitter you can stop and read it if you want um yeah that's that um let's see i think that's i think that's it i'm pretty sure that's everything yeah that's everything then the you know you got the information card over here all the things that we got and then this cute little like postcard thing i think this has to do with the bl drama cd it's like the same thing so but yeah that's pretty much everything that was in the box um personally i do think it was worth it um this is licensed stuff um that takes a lot if you've ever bought dojins before you know dojins are super expensive because there's you know there's self-published um books you know a manga self-published manga not books self-published manga um and they're really well like drawn and these are really well drawn like and the the quality of them are really nice um the paper quality is very thick they're not see-through um yeah they're really nice looking yeah let me see what else do i gotta say oh and also let's see I do want to mention that it looks like um, Yaoi Crate was also also partnered with Rot and Blossoms because they were, you know, these two doujins were by them and so was the BL drama CD. So I'm guessing that they're going to be in future boxes as well, which is exciting because I'm excited to see more of what um, this box has to offer. Um, since this is the first box, um, I really I really liked what I got in it, to be honest. It's definitely 100% worth it. Like I said, doujins are really expensive. Um, I only own one other doujin and that cost me like $20. So those two 20 bucks 40 dollars already just in the doujins and then the pin which is a really high quality pin uh the one that says like uh proud fujo was probably i would give it the cheapest maybe 10 maybe probably more because it has like two little um things in the back so i don't know how much of it yeah it has like two little clips in the back so i'm not sure how much that would be but it's definitely over ten dollars so that those three alone is worth more than the box so yeah like i said i really enjoyed this um box if you like yaoi related things um please go check out this box i'll like put their um their website in the description so you can check them out and um also link the twitters of the two doujin artists as well so you can check them out too because the art looks really nice and um yeah i would love supporting little creators um and becoming so they become bigger because you know that's how you work you work bottom up and it's always good to support what you love and i love fujo related things so this was definitely 100 percent worth it in my opinion um yeah i already have the next box already pre-ordered so i'm excited for that one i guess since i'm gonna continue doing this box i might just do videos every time i get it and just post it up here so um yeah sorry if this video was all over the place i was just really excited and um oh, please ignore my dry ass lips Ugh, i'm wearing this stupid ass mask all day has like dried out my mouth but whatever um what was i saying yes so sorry that everything was like all over the place i was just really excited and uh i really wanted to show you guys what i got and uh i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you got this box or if you plan on buying this box or whatever just check out the out you know check out their twitter the yaoi crates um check out their instagram they're definitely 100 percent worth it and they're legit which i'm happy about um i really hate having you know paying people for you know bootleg items and stuff like that so it's good to have items that are licensed and you know the money you know the money's going in a good place so yeah thank you guys so much for watching uh please like or subscribe bye